So this is about climate change and the greenhouse effect. So let's just learn about what the greenhouse effect is first. This is planet Earth and this is the sun and when the sun heats up the Earth, the Earth absorbs the heat and then it radiates it back out. Now what happens is that there are a few gases which trap and block the heat as it's trying to escape and those gases which you need to know are carbon dioxide, methane and water vapour and they are called the greenhouse gases and if they weren't there the temperature of the earth would be about minus 18 degrees. We're looking at those three greenhouse gases which are in the air either naturally or because of man. Carbon dioxide levels are going up. We're burning more fossil fuels. Carbon dioxide is also released by respiration and decreased as plants take it in for photosynthesis. Methane levels are going up too. We're using more cattle and cattle release methane by burping and farting. Methane is also released by decomposing matter and by waste which is buried. Water vapour, now that occurs in the air naturally and there's lots of it there but it's not really caused by human activity. This is a reminder of how the greenhouse effect works. Short wavelength electromagnetic radiation is radiated by the sun and absorbed by the earth. The earth then radiates that heat as a slightly longer wavelength infrared and that wavelength is then absorbed by greenhouse gases thereby warming the atmosphere. Now what we do know is that the average global temperature although it varies it has increased over the last 150 years and we can see that in the graph. We've got some problems though with measuring the average global temperature. The earth is a big place and we need to take temperatures in lots of different places around the world, some of them remote. And also we're looking at a long time period. If we want to get all the data we're looking at collecting it over 150 years. Now it's not just greenhouse gases which may have caused this increase in temperature. Let's look at dust. Smoke from this factory, that's man-made, that reflects radiation back down to earth. That's going to cause global warming. Dust from this volcano, that's natural, that reflects radiation back up to the sun. That's going to cause global cooling. So what do we know? Well, we know that the average global temperature has gone up over the last 150 years. We also know that due to human activity, carbon dioxide levels have gone up and methane levels have gone up. So we know that there is a correlation, a link between carbon dioxide levels and methane levels and an increased global temperature. But do we know that human activity has directly caused this increase in temperature? That we don't know.